Hello, hello, Kenny Evans here, another car video. And the topic of this video is called, there's nothing wrong with being a weak beta man. I know, some of y'all are probably like, wait, what? <laughs> are you serious right now talking about that? But I'm serious. There really is nothing wrong with it. Of course, I'm going to get into it a little bit more in detail as the video goes on. But first, for all y'all who are new or haven't done it yet, like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate it. You know, let me know what you think about the video. You know, and uh, of course, if you find value or if you just want to support me, I appreciate all donations. You know what I mean? So, let's begin. So again, the topic of this video is there's nothing wrong with being a weak beta man. And I'm serious. I really am. Because as you guys may know, um, we got a lot of different men out here in the world. You know, and sure, I promote being a strong man confident man alpha man you know but that takes a lot of work <laughs> you know especially with women and in life you know but when it comes to this this topic we got to realize not all men want or can be with multiple women and that's the first 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 thing to realize not all men can or want to be with multiple women. Some guys just want to be with one woman. They will just stick it out for as long as they have to or until she leaves or death do them part if they get married. You know what I mean? And there's really nothing wrong with that in, in, inherently. But these men who want to be with that one woman, they haven't vetted that woman. They haven't dated most multiple women to find if she's the best for her, for him, for him. You know, so that's the thing. But some guys will just, they want a woman so bad, they'll, you know, they'll get the first woman who they find attractive and they'll go on to the second one. First woman they find attractive um, they'll stick with her and sticking with the first woman who finds you attractive and getting in a relationship with her is fine. It's the second point there. Again, it, it kind of coincides with the first one. You just want to have a girlfriend or a wife. So the first woman who you find attractive and then you find she finds you attractive you are doing what you can to seal the deal with her and make her exclusive with you. You know, and um, you don't know how come she, she finds you attractive or what she truly finds you attractive for. It, it could be for your looks. It could be just because she thinks you're rich and wants your money. It could be for your status and what she could gain. Or it could just be because she wants to be married because she feels like she's had her fun, and now it's just time to settle down. But hey, you just want to be with her, and she just wants to be with you. So you got to do what you got to do, right? There's nothing wrong. You know, no betting, just going with the first woman you find attractive and who finds you attractive. It's fine. And of course, with all this, it's always easier to do what your woman wants. Because when you do what she wants, then in theory, you make her happy. You know? And with that, then you have the old motto, happy wife, happy life. You know? When you do what she wants, you have that motto, happy wife, happy life. It doesn't matter what she she does. Your goal is to make her happy. And in theory, that is great. It's very honorable. 
You know, you want to make the, the woman in your life happy. It doesn't matter that she doesn't want to make you happy. That's not her pro top priority, but that's your top priority. You got to make her happy. You know, it doesn't matter if she wants to, you know, spend all the money in the bank account. It doesn't matter if she wants to have guy friends. It doesn't matter if she wants to go on play dates with the, those guy friends and female friends. It doesn't matter if she wants to stay out all night long. It doesn't matter. As long as she's happy, then you should be happy. Because that will make your life happier. And she's happy. You know? So, <laughs> and that is important. And I'm being serious. You know what I mean? Because there's nothing wrong with being, uh, making sure you're, the woman you're associated with or you're dating or in a relationship with is happy. You know, but of course, you got to realize that when it comes to making her happy, you have to become the man that your woman wants. Because becoming the man that your woman wants will obviously make, <sighs> make you be better. For her, of course, in her life. <laughs> of course, she, she'll she lose respect for you. You know, um, she will inherently be miserable. And sure, so will you. Um, but of course, you'll think, hey, this is what you have to do. You got to be this guy who she wants. You want to be all that she wants. You you assume and believe that what she tells you she wants in a man is what she truly wants in a man. You know, you assume she just really knows. You know what I mean? And it's just not what she feels. It's what she thinks. You assume her thoughts. They just have to be 100% accurate. You know, and... And inherently, of course, in, in theory, you would think that is great. Of course, all women know what they want. You know? All women know what they want in a man. But then, of course, when it comes to the other side of that, is she bettering, her, bettering herself for you? Nah, it doesn't matter. Because you are bettering yourself for her and becoming the man that she wants. But she doesn't have to become the woman you want, of course. Because again, happy wife, happy life. And of course, it is easier for you to do what your woman wants. You know, so. I, and again, this is, like I said, it is harder work and hard work to become a, a strong man. To become an alpha man, confident, it takes work. So I'm being serious about it. It truly is. There's nothing wrong with uh, being a, a weak beta man because it's easy. And some guys like the easier life. It's not for me, but some guys like it. You know, especially when it comes to women, because again, they can't. Or they don't want to be with multiple women. You know, so I'm being completely serious with this whole video. You know, for real. I mean, of course, I wouldn't advise becoming a weak man. But it is easier. It's easier to be a weak man than a strong man, for sure. You know what I mean? So that's all I got for y'all today. You know, again... Another reminder, if you enjoy this video or if you just want to support, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you would like to, uh, about the video. Let me know if you agreed with what I said or I didn't. Or if you don't agree with what I said. Or let me know if there's something I missed about uh, being a, a weak man. Let me know in the comment section. Of course, um, again, if you enjoy the video, if you just want to support me, donate. 
I appreciate all donations. And last but not least, of course, hit that notification bell, of course. So you're notified whenever I make uh, other videos here. But let me know. I've been saying this for weeks. Let me know what other topics you'd like me to talk about. You know, I don't really have an email that I'd like for y'all to, to send me to, send emails to right now. But you can do it here in the comment section. Let me know what other topics of videos you would like me to talk about. It's very simple. Because again, this channel is for you guys. And I want to be able to help this channel uh, grow in the way you guys want it to grow. You know. So, and it doesn't have to be uh, dating. It could be all life. For men and women even. You know what I mean? But of course, when it comes to the women... It's going to be targeted and centered towards men. This is the man's first channel, but not men only channel. But, uh, of course, um, you know, that's all I got for y'all here. And until next week, stay safe. I'll see y'all then. And always remember, the strongest man is the happiest man. <laughs>